hanging out in the city park in Junction. Junction City, we don't, I don't know. I thought it was just Junction, Junction, Texas. Junction City, I don't know, but it's the city park in Junction, Texas. And they have a free camping, no frills camping. There are bathrooms on site, but there's no dump site, no hookups. Uh, first come, first serve, uh, but it has a three day limit, which isn't bad. So it's a, it's a cute little park. And we have been here, and we are going to have to head home, unfortunately, today. Yeah, today's Sunday. We arrived on Friday, right? Yeah. Friday. Friday. And uh, we spent most of the day yesterday, Saturday, doing all the activities we could around here. We rode the bikes uh, into town and around the area. Uh, we did some kayaking in the uh, river right here. This is the uh, Leno? Some branch of the Leno, I think. I think yeah. like the south. I don't know. What Lano River or something like that. I'm not sure. You have to Google that to <laughs> what, what it actually is. Because yeah. we often guess and get it wrong. We'll let you know. Uh, yeah. But it, it's really gorgeous. Really perfect place to go kayaking. There's a spillway down there. That, so the water here is kind of like a, a big swimming area. You can take the kayak either direction up and down the stream very easily. So it's a really great place to go kayaking. And right, literally behind where this camera is, are steps down into the water. So we parked our bus right by where we could go straight in if uh, we want to. So we're sad we have to leave already. <laughs> yeah, three days wasn't enough. We got here Friday night. But we were parked down there. But this is then we moved because when we went on our bike ride, we saw this, and I said that's better. We need to move. It's easier for our kayak to come down. Well, on this, so for this side of the park, because there's a swim day use area on the other side of the river, on the other side of the bridge, but for this side that allows camping, this step stairs right here are, is really the only way to safely get in and out of the water without going through a bunch of brush and stuff like this, you see. Uh, so we parked next to where we could get in so we didn't have to drag our kayaks or really long way across the entire park. We spent like maybe two hours in the water yesterday kayaking. Uh, on the other side where the uh, day use is, uh, there was tons of families out there. We're on the north side of the river. On the south side there, there was tons of families just gathered. Many families actually. Yeah, I feel like this is like the local swimming hole, most likely. So most of it was day use. We haven't seen a lot of campers actually. Uh, 
it was really easy to just pull up to this premium spot on a beautiful weekend, no reservations. It was available, it was, it, you know, in the middle of the day on a Saturday, so it wasn't like there was a lot of people coming out here, uh, a lot of competition for camping. But on that, there there is plenty of space, though. Yeah. For people to bring their rigs or campers. There, there's even a park across the street where uh, a large family was actually tent camping. They had like uh, three to four different tents. And it's a big gazebo. Yeah. It's just got so much good use of the nature, the scenery, and all this. It's just, it's, na it's a natural, natural playground, uh, which is really wonderful. Uh, and it's just a pretty little town, and we've, locals have been pretty friendly. And, yeah. uh, you know, it's been really great. And we're, de we're already talking about when we're going to come back. We're looking to come back. Maybe we spoke about the 4th of July. We're not sure, but uh, we're talking about it, at least. Because this isn't far for us. This is only about three hours from our home base. So it's really easy for us to come out here on the weekend. It's really <laughs> easy for me to watch David drive us out here on the weekend. <laughs> and then watch him drive us back. Yay. Yay. Anyway, so we like this location. It's our first time here. We, we, we heard about it through YouTubers, actually, uh, who have been out here. Yeah, I think Driving and Vibin. Driving and Vibin. Freedom Theory, I think they are. Freedom Theory. Oh. So we want to try it out also. It's really beautiful. It's, it's nice. And you there's a lot of nature. But what? not only that, what? you can enjoy the view from out here, but guys, from inside our rig, Oh yeah. it looks amazing. You know? Yeah, the view in there is great. Yeah, the, the windows are just so perfectly lined up that, you know, we have this huge bridge out here and it just, you know, it just, it just, it just opens up so much, you know? And we're down in this little, like, valley that's kind of surrounded by these mountains. So, it's just really kind of pretty everywhere you look anyway. Um, it's a cute little town that's just nestled in some really gorgeous landscapes. Yeah, we like it. Sunrise this morning was amazing too, though. I wouldn't know. I wasn't up for that. <laughs> you get up that early. <laughs> I don't do that on the weekend. I only get up early on work days. <laughs> mm -hmm. Anyway, I enjoyed the uh, sunrise. It was great. You know what? And the dogs, actually. The dogs enjoyed it as well. There was a lot of smells for them out here. Oh, New yeah. smells. And they really, really enjoyed it. They always do. They like it. They love that. That's the favorite thing whenever we get to a new campsite. We put them out on their long leashes so they can come out and sniff. And they love to smell all the new smells. Especially when we go somewhere where it has like wildlife. They always sniff where the wildlife is. But the city park, you know, I'm sure other people have brought their dogs out here. And so there's lots of, lots of juicy things for the sniff around here. <laughs> oh. All right, we're going to take a... Uh bicycle ride uh, in toward the park and uh, show you some of that as well. Yeah, I need to put my bicycle clothes on. She needs bicycle clothes. So we're going to cut to that and uh, show you the rest of the park. Alright guys. Yeah, don't turn around, you'll fall. I will fall if I can reach. It's better than Walmart. Yep.
the other eagles in the that corner we just left? Uh, I want to see it. Let's go see it. October came all the way up here and chopped his head off and so that's a new head. Yeah. <laughs> that's where we came in on Friday. Yeah. Friday night, kind of late, 10 o'clock. Yeah, we just pretty much parked in the first place that fit our bus. It's yeah. Dark. And uh then uh, Saturday morning, we went for a bike ride. Um, we actually spotted that location over there, so now we are parked up there, closer to the bridge. And we thought we'd have an issue with the cars passing by on top of the bridge and how loud it was going to be, but... It's not a very fast bridge. And it's not that much traffic. Not much traffic, so we didn't have to worry about it. Hey, where were you in 1990? Okay. I was like three. <laughs> little? I was little. How many little were you? Like three little. 87, 88, 89. I was like three. Three littles. Three little. I was three littles. Swim across. I know. I uh, we are parked and over lake. here. Cable and lake area are out of bounds. Well, they call that a lake. I guess it is a lake. South Lano River. So that answers the question what river it is. Yep. Yep. I'm going to drive through the playground now. If you wish. Oh yeah. Oh no. Oh no. This is a real slide, cat. You would slide on this one. Let's go up this way, kid. Oh shit. <laughs> I fell. There you go, I'll take it up. Cat, that was pretty good. The last time I did this it didn't slide. Oh, it's actually still the break. <laughs> good, that one's funner. You gotta get all the way around the obstacle course. Well, I remember these though as a child. Oh my goodness. Yes. Well, you climbed that pole. <laughs> yeah. You worked it pretty good. <laughs> yeah. You did it. When I was a little kid, those seemed a lot higher. It was like, oh, it's like nothing. It was like two climbs. I want to see the other playground. It's more funner. Awesome. It's an obstacle horse. Knock yourself out. 
I don't want to do that. I'm going to get hurt. I'm going to start with the hardest one first. I'm about to feel how out of shape I am. Yeah, you are. This isn't a slide, is it? It can't be a slide. That's not safe. What the hell is this? I'm so confused by this thingy. You s skateboard? Cat. Can't fall off. I want to try it. Yeah, you're out of shape. It's gonna be great. Here. Yeah. All right. Next, all next up on the obstacle course is David. That's how you do it. Bye bye, old parking spot. Yeah, we, we were going home. 
but we've been looking at this bridge all week, so now we're gonna try across it. 